madness. What have you done, Charles? He slaughters his own servants. Madness. Two keys. I should look around. You come in, my king, please! Come on. I will burn you! I know your fear! I have fire! I'm not him. I am not the king. Gods. A key. Could work on the door in the main hall. Strange. A Christian holy book. No key inside. She's the angel, the, the saint, the one who shimmers with the Lord's light. And so they were right about me. All of them were right. I know. We are what they say. It has always been us. Even as they seared me, I feigned to be purged of all demons. <laughs> But I knew. No amount of burning would rid me of you. And burn me they did. Below this scarred flesh, you were still there. You were still here. You have 
always been here. I embrace you, demon. Louder. We are the demon. We are... I am not the only demon who lurks in these chambers. No one is allowed in here. Least of all, I know from the heathen! Your wailing and fight me! I could lock him in this room. You will bleed! No! Oh, 
Oh, Charles! What have they done to you? What have I done to you? It did not have to be this way. His death is payment for the many he has killed, and a mercy for those he was yet to. Speak not of mercy while his blood is still warm. What you have done was driven by selfishness and anger, not mercy. Charles was a threat to my clan. He was mad beyond reason. And should your clan be a threat to one of your neighbors, I hope God grants them the wisdom you lack. Now leave us. Just know, Charles will never honor our bond with you northerners. Unlike him, my word can be trusted. Ha! You are no more than a wounded dog at my table looking for scraps. How dare you! Wait! Eivor! Finally we can talk sense. What of Richardis? Did you encounter Charles? Richardis yet lives. Charles does not. 
This is an unexpected gift. That makes today a day for celebration. It has been curious to know you, Eivor. You are as enigmatic as any Northerner I have met. He is hoping there are more like you. I must go now and attend the throne. I wish you a safe journey back to England. Your greatest challenges lie before you, Count Odo. I hope you have the strength. As do I. Is it wise to put our trust in him? The future is a mystery. Whether Odo will even attain his ambition is unclear. Then how am I to proceed? I cannot tell you that. You are the leader of your people now. Your instinct will determine their future. I have much to consider. Stay true to your honor and bring glory to your people. If you do that, you cannot fail. I will send word should the Franks grow an appetite for England again. To your relations with Odo, consider returning to him the lands that Charles pledged to Siegfried. No. Those lands are compensation for the hardship he has caused us. Odo kept Paris. That is enough. You sound more Jarl-like all the time. And now I must think of my own people, whom I've been away from for too long. Before you go, have this. It was my father, Sinrix, the second best leader and teacher I have known. It has been my honor. I hope to lead as well as you do, Eivor. If ever you hunger for more Frankish cheese, I will be happy to share. <laughs> Farewell, Tog. You must have heard about Charles. We have eyes and ears everywhere. You did the right thing, Ivor. Frankia will have a better king. One you might even be inclined to follow. That remains to be seen. For now, loyalists rise to resist the change. We will continue our missions. How can I help? Back to England? To England. Off we go, then. Eivor!
Are we safe? It will be many winters before Frankish troops land on the English shore. My spies say Paris fell. It did. But the situation is thornier than that. In what way? I killed the Mad King, Charles the Fat. Odo, the Count of Paris, means to take the throne. Is that good for us? Time will tell. But Odo is an honorable man, and he has a kingdom to rebuild. That is comforting. We also have a hardy ally in Toka Sinrik's daughter. She is young. And a quick study. <laughs> She'll do right by us. Perhaps they need not know the danger we face. We came home with bounty, glory, and some Frankish foods. I can ask the raiders to keep their tails to that. They will say everything, and then some. <laughs> Afraid so. <laughs>